Hey gamers, Devin here, and today I'm going to take you through the process of hacking in Fallout. So at its core, hacking in Fallout is actually extremely simple. It's all just based on the process of elimination. Whenever you boot up a computer, it's going to generate a lot of random words to throw you off, but one of those words is correct. Now the first word doesn't really matter, so you'll see in this first example, I click the word shut. Each time you click on a word, a prompt at the bottom right will tell you if that word is correct or wrong, and if it's wrong, it'll tell you the number of likenesses. Likenesses refers to how many columns have their correct letter. What I mean by that is if you take this word shut and you draw a line between each letter, S would be in column 1, H would be in column 2, U would be in column 3, and T would be in column 4. And so in the case of shut, we know that one of these four columns has the correct letter. So we need to look for a word that matches in one column and doesn't match in the other three. Here you'll see that with star, you'll see that column 1 both has S, while column 2 through 4 are all different letters. So there's a good chance that this is actually our word. And boom, we're in. All right, so in this example, I click bomb, which as you see has zero likenesses. That means in quadrant four, no matter what, there's not a B, in quadrant two, there's not an O, in quadrant three, there's not an M, and in quadrant four, there's not a B. So since bomb and ball both share a B in quadrant one, I know that that's not the correct word. However, when I clicked part, you'll see that there's one likeness, which means that either the P, the A, the R, or the T is correct. After clicking labs, is back to zero likenesses, which means, just for clicking these three words, we know that in these four quadrants, none of these letters match, with the exception of partially P, R, or T. Thus, the answer is not race, it's not crap. The answer in this case is most likely wire, because wire doesn't share any similarities with bomb or labs, but it shares one similarity with part. Now, if you take a second here, you'll notice that at the top left, it says attempts remaining. However, not wanting to take the risk of locking myself out of a computer, there's a little trick you can do in Fallout. All you have to do to get more tries in hacking in Fallout is exit the computer. Note though that when you log in, although your tries will be replenished, the words will also be reset, so you'll be starting from the ground up again. And who knows? You might just get lucky on the first try. Happy hacking! Hey gamers, if you or any of your friends play Fallout, be sure to share this guide on your Facebook and your Twitter, that way they can learn to hack just as well as you can. Because now, you're pro at it, you just went like 10 levels higher. Also, if you have any suggestions for future Fallout videos, leave a comment down below and maybe I'll be able to make some more guides to help you guys out. And if you haven't already, be sure to click that subscribe button. And while you're at it, why don't you click this last video right over here. Well, in reality, you really cannot punch me. No! <laughs> why would you say that? That can't go in the video! That can't go in the video! Never!